Yaga Africa has urged the government to shun the use of police and other security agencies during elections. The executive director of the group, Samson Utodo, made the appeal on Thursday in Akure, the Ondo state capital, ahead of the governorship election in the state. He also asked the security agencies to ensure the protection of voters, observer groups, media and vulnerable voters, especially women and persons with disabilities. The executive director believes voter turnout may increase if the security agencies prove that the environment is secure for them to exercise their franchise. We're going to consider a range of factors and this means that before we can conclude that Saturday's election satisfies the electoral integrity test, we would look at one, pre-election issues and whether or not the pre-election environment um, was safe and secure that gives voters an opportunity to cast their votes in a peaceful and secure manner, that the electoral commission is also giving the independence that it requires to manage the elections, that also security agencies are non-partisan, professional in their management of election security operations. Yaga Africa's pre-election observation findings revealed a consistent trend of violence and arms stockpiling across some local government areas in the state. More worrisome, is the attack on some female party supporters. Given the background of pre-election violence and gangster politics, the state may witness a further decline in voter turnout. The low, vote, the low turnout may further enhance chances for electoral manipulation in the strongholds of the major political parties, particularly in rural areas where election rigging usually takes place. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.